Hello, this is Paul, and I'm here to document uh, the problem of transparency I was having in uh, Blender when I was uh, running under Linux Mint Cinnamon 17.3. So, uh, first, let's establish the other programs. The transparency does work. So, I'm in Krita, and if I uh, sit right here and I can draw, and I have the transparency grid. So, in this program, this kind of thing displays no problems. And I can go on a different layer and I can select it here and see they draw different layers just fine. For transparency, you see the checker grid. So, we know it works in Krita. You know, this is a blender thing, it's just showing how other stuff is working. So, Krita. And the same on the GIMP. We got transparency grid, you see it displays, and it works. So, it's just to show that they work under the setup. So, it can't just be this specific setup. So, now we go to. Blender, which I have a shortcut here. And we boot it up. I'm not doing anything special at the scene or anything else. This is 2.77 and it's what you saw in the little thing there. <laughs> Anyhow, it's a default scene. I'm not changing anything. I'm not loading anything. It's just a default scene. So, I'm going to do a quick render, and this is default transparency. See, everything works as it should. So, first, let's mess with the Blender internal render. And what should be happening is. I'm trying to remember where it is. Bear with me, because I usually don't use this when I use cycles more often. Somewhere here. Da -da 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 -da. I think it might be under world settings. I remember where they hid a hid the little thing for the ah here it is it's under shading okay so I just click transparent and what this should do is render with the transparent alpha background and if you look under the output settings where is it on? It's, it's a little different internal like I said I usually don't use it a lot. It's under PNG, but the PNG is also set to RGBA, so that can't be the issue. It's set with RGB and alpha. So you see that's toggled up. Alright. So that's the conditions I'm rendering in. And I click render. And as you see, there is no alpha grid. I'm used to seeing 2.77. I know my other version is on windows side but still the thing is I showed other programs where alpha grid actually displays and here there is no alpha grid but if I go under compositing click on use nodes this little render layers window there is the alpha grid so why is it not showing in the main display so in a way it does work but for some reason it's not being passed on to the graphic driver. I'm guessing that's what's going on. So there is an alpha grid in here, but for some reason in the main render display when it's rendered, it doesn't display. And if I click here, we can see it. there is an alpha mask and stuff going on. So it's just not showing up with the grid. <laughs> and so now I will do the same under cycles. Under cycles. Let's see. I will go... It should be under right here. Film, set that to transparent. Same kind of thing. Click render. Does this render? So we have proof that transparency is there, but it is not displayed. Again, I didn't change anything, so this is still has the alpha on it. And, excuse me here, and go to, not that one, 
there's a compositing layout and you can see here that there is alpha there and it is showing the grid like it should in the other window but it's not showing in the main window I don't know why it's doing it and let's see uh, terminal still very new to Linux so bear with me <laughs> I think what is it uh, I and Z or something like that. Yeah. Okay, let me widen this out and I can see what's going on here. So I'm learning under the 3.19 kernel, which I guess is normal for uh, the Cinnamon 70.3. And here I have a gigabyte motherboard. It has the standard chipset on it. I haven't changed anything. MD Fellows and all that. The thing is, is the uh, display is, uh, see, I have, seeing this RS-880, but it's actually a radiant, this is the chipset I actually have, it's 4200. But it's using a generic driver because ATI chipset for some reason isn't it working right. It's just, they don't support this, ATI doesn't support the 4200. Why? I don't know. It works on the Windows side, but for this. So I'm using, I guess, what is it? The GLX is the Mesa render. So see, it worked under Krita and Gimp. I don't know why it's not working. But it did work in Blender under the compositing window, so something's goofy going on under here. So that's what I figured I'd let you guys know, and... I guess that will be it, and I'll have to go over back to my Windows partition. I'll move the file over because I have problems with wireless so <laughs> I couldn't get wireless working here so that's another story though but that's not for blender guys to worry about that's for me to figure out. Alright. That's that.